and the action. All right, guys, I am on the Extreme Bull. This is probably the best EUC I've ever ridden in terms of the full package here. You got a huge battery with a lot of range. You have 134 volts. The people's biggest complaint with the Sherman S was that it was only 100 volts. This is a 134 volt wheel, 3,600 watt battery. It's got a nice trolley handle and it has this hybrid tire on there, which is kind of like a new type of tire they're putting on there. This is the V2 version. Has a pretty nice, pretty nice uh, spin out. Let's do a little spin out test here real quick so you guys can see. Woo! It's fast. Uh, yeah, so this was the UC I was racing on. I've crashed it a bunch, I've dropped it a bunch. And so far, the only damage you can really see is uh, you can see some of the scuffs, but that's not that bad, you know? It's really not that bad. You just drop it and it scuffs up a bit. But other than that, this is a solid piece of kit. Really enjoying it. So we're gonna ride around a bit and I'm just gonna kind of talk as we're riding. I have Psycho Therapeutic, one of the best EUC riders in the world. Number three in Spain here recording me. We're gonna safely, we're not gonna go fast guys. We don't have helmets on or gear, so we're just gonna go nice. We're gonna show you a little bit of Seville and uh, hopefully you guys enjoy the show. Ring -a -ling -a -ling -a -ling. <laughs> Lots of beautiful senoritas. Do, 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 do. All right, so yeah, the Extreme Bull Commander. Right now I chose to stay on the right side of the sidewalk because I wanted to keep the flow going, but I might try to go across here to get onto the bike path. Bike paths here in Sevilla, the bike paths are amazing. And they go around the entire city for the most part. So if you're ever like feeling uncomfortable with riding in the streets or on the sidewalk, just cross over and we got a red light. Oh, turn green. A lot of times here, you can cross on a red light. It's kind of like New York style where the light's red, but you can look and see that nobody's coming on either side. The big problem with here in Sevilla is you gotta look out for scooters because, yeah, <laughs> you might run into a scooter or they might run into you. So you gotta always stay focused on what's going on around you. See right here, we got our, uh, uh, oh, it just turned green for us, but it was red and we were gonna go anyways because we know that there aren't any cars coming. It's really, Sevilla is like a little New York in terms of riding it's very like tons of bike paths but you got to be like super alert and you probably should always wear your gear we're riding super slow right now and we're both professional riders but i do not recommend riding without a helmet knee pads wrist guards all that stuff unless you're a professional professional <laughs> now even as a professional you you don't want to not wear your gear all right so we're going to cross the street here we're gonna take you guys to a park where we like to work out. It's a nice place to work out, not too far from here. It's right across from Psycho's house. We can do some pull-ups there. Oh, we got a green. Look at the senorita coming up here. Woo! Little senorita. Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't seem like even most of the like scooter riders and uh, uh, anyone that's riding like a PEV, they don't really wear too much gear. Not too much gear at all. You can kind of step. Woo. The commander, man. The commander has the acceleration and the power of the master, but it's also got the bigger battery. So you don't really have to worry about range. I don't worry about range on this EUC. It's just so nice to flow on it. The suspension's so clean. I love the hydraulic suspension. Just feels so good and I'm running the Clark C3 BioPad, so man, it just it just feels amazing. This UC is definitely, in terms of feeling, the two my two favorite or three favorite EUCs, I would say Commander Pro in terms of suspension, the three best suspension EUCs. S22 is probably number one. Commander Pro number two, and then Sherman S number three. And I may even put Commander Pro number one. The hydraulic suspension. The only question I have is how long is it going to last? Because right now it's great. It feels amazing. But after maybe like a thousand or 2000 miles, is it still going to be good? Is it still going to be uh, crispy and smooth? 
the police here are uh, taking notice. <laughs> oh, we better not go because there's a police right there. Normally we just go across, but there's a police right there watching us. So, okay, no it's no problem. Okay. Yeah. The, that's a national police. National okay. police? National. Uh, are, here are two differences. The local police or the national police. Okay. The national police will not break your balls. The they will not break police, the balls? Yeah. Ah, why? Because they got more important stuff to do? Yeah. It's the local police that are like bored and like, yeah. oh, I'm going to mess with this guy. Okay. That's good to know. So how do you tell the difference between national police and local police? Because uh, the uh, color of the cars. The color it's of the, the cars? The, the national police. It's the dark one. The dark one, okay. The yellow one with the poly is the local police. Oh, okay. It's a different one. Okay. So, stereo. Oh, we got a green. Okay, stereo. All right, stereo. So we're trying stereo. We're using the DJI, DJI mic. This is uh, kind of, we're experimenting with the DJI mic here. And so far it's good, but sometimes you mess up like a setting. We don't know if we need a mono or stereo. So we're gonna play around with it right now, test it out, see what it feels like, see what it sounds like. But uh, this is like Seville right here. There's parks like this everywhere. Lots of green spaces, lots of flowers, lots of places to work out, lots of off-road tracks. Really makes me wanna smoke some weed, but I uh, don't have any. So I'm gonna go sober for a while. <laughs> but man, look at how beautiful this place is. This is like your backyard. This is Psycho's backyard right here. He literally lives across the street from this place and it's just like... Cool. I think that's a cool little short taste of Seville for you guys. I might edit this into a YouTube review or use it for something, but this is more of just a test for us to test the uh, microphone and see how it works. What I'd like to do is we're gonna put the microphone on Psycho and he's gonna take us around and talk to us about his history in electric unicycle. He's been riding for eight years. So we're gonna go through his story and do like a highlight of his history in the EUC world, show you all the wheels he had and then uh, the wheel he's on now, the V12 and then T4 will take you from the beginning of his journey. I think it was a solo wheel was his first wheel. And now he's on a T4 and soon maybe get a master. So hope you guys enjoyed this little taste of our content and we'll have more to come. Till next time, stay in the Zen Zone. <laughs>